uh, my story is similar to Aaron's. Uh, my father was there for my mother. You know, when, when things was good with my mom, that's when my dad was around. When things wasn't good with my mom, he was he, he wasn't there. So he he wasn't a superhero to me. He was he was there off and on. Uh, my sister right above me, I got three brothers, three sisters. My sister right above me is 40. I'm 26, so there's a big break between between my, my sister and then me, and I had two brothers under me. And my mom and my dad split up after my sister. He was in their lives. He had me and my uh, siblings, and after that, he was in the night, so. Like, my dad was in and out, like, every five years. Like, he never had a relationship with my mom. Last time I remember seeing him when I was little, when I was, like, two, he was walking out the kitchen. Then when I met him again when I got older, I found out I had, like, five sisters that I knew and went to school with, but never knew that we was related. Now he back he back here, he got into some trouble down in Florida. He trying to have a relationship with me now. So like for me to become a better father and a better man, I let that go. Just have a relationship with him now. Can't fall him for the past no more. He's already gone. Can't get it back. My my father, truthfully my father was my grandmother, you know, so like I said, my father wasn't in my life. I found out who my father was when I turned twenty one. My twenty first birthday. Kind of tripped me out. Who he was as, as to his identity? Right. Okay. You know, kind of tripped me out because I've been knowing this man all my life. Mm -hmm. I've been seeing this man every day of my life, but never even knew, you know. Man stayed right around the corner from me. My brother, my stepbrother, rather, his other son, that he actually was in his life, we was tight. We played football. We, <laughs> whole bunch of stuff, man. We had girls together and everything. <laughs> and it, it was tripped up because every day, I, I would look at my brother and everybody would rib and say, yo, man, y'all look just alike, man. Y'all brothers and stuff, you know. But we would act like brothers, but we never knew we was brothers until my wow. 21st birthday, you know. And um, Was anybody mad when you found out? I mean, was well, your brother upset at you? to be truthfully, like I said, it was my 21st birthday. So, you know, I, my, my intentions was get a bottle of Henny, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, and just go out and just party. And that's what I did. And I ended up seeing him at a bar. And I was with my mother. And she was like, well, he's 21 now. I guess it's time to tell him. Mm. Mm. You know, I'm... And, and, what? I'm sober now. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So I had so many questions and I had so much on my mind and my heart was just beating real fast and stuff. You know what I mean? I ended up fainting. Mm. Yeah, and they took me to the hospital. You know, but the next day, he was there. And I, I never drank until I turned 21. Mm. So when I first started drinking and stuff, I haven't stopped. <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing is that, is impre that, that impresses me about that conversation mm -hmm. is the blood calls. Yeah, it does. You, it you, does. Not knowing that that was your yeah. brother, you and still, still had that connection. There. Yeah, that we, right we, there we is was like, like wow. we was really like that. We still is like uh, that. That's you know wow. what I mean?